Gestational diabetes is an obstetric complication described in this pigmonic by the pregnant woman with the dyed bead pancreas jewelry she wears around her neck. This disorder is usually asymptomatic, shown by the thumbs up, and is typically discovered during screening tests. Women with this condition are at high risk of birthing children with fetal macrosomia, the big baby with macromacaroni, and there is also a greater risk of polyhydramnios, described by the polyfluid in the womb, which refers to excessive volume of amniotic fluid. Diagnosis of gestational diabetes is made when screening tests show glucose intolerance after 24 weeks gestation. The glue bottle intolerance with the 222 and the 4 fork. Initially, a 1 hour 50 gram glucose challenge test is done to screen. And if this is positive, a 3 hour 100 gram glucose tolerance test is done, illustrated as the 3 tree and the $100 bill with the glue bottle. This test is performed after an overnight fast, and to test positive for gestational diabetes, the patient must have abnormal glucose levels at two or more time points while the test is being administered. Treatment for gestational diabetes begins with diet and exercise, shown by the nutritional plate and the character exercising on the treadmill. Additionally, patients should have close glucose monitoring, the glue bottle and the monitor. And for those who fail diet and exercise, insulin is the gold standard for therapy, shown as the insect syringe, in this disease, fetal growth and well-being are assessed with ultrasound or non-stress tests, depicted as the ultrasound machine. Often, delivery, shown by the stork delivering a baby, is curative and is one of the most viable treatment options. So let's quickly go over gestational diabetes. This disorder is usually asymptomatic, but eventually leads to fetal macrosomia and polyhydramnios. Diagnosis is made through screening tests that show glucose intolerance after 24 weeks of gestation and confirmed with a 3-hour 100-gram glucose tolerance test. Treatment options include diet and exercise and close glucose monitoring. Some patients may require insulin, along with regular ultrasounds or non-stress tests. Delivery is often curative for this disorder. Ever have one of those friends that are so successful that it makes you sick? Well, that's the theme for our gestational diabetes pigmonic. Just imagine having brunch with that one friend that can't stop bragging about how perfect your life is. She's pregnant and shoves her expensive dyed bead pancreas jewelry in your face. Life's so great she's constantly giving you the thumbs up and her baby is already spoiled, eating only the finest macaroni and priceless poly. For the rest of the story, check out pigmonic.com and sign up for a free account. There, you can also take pigmonic's quiz. The quiz automatically sets up your daily quiz by using spaced repetition algorithms based on the questions you've missed or struggled with to make sure you study what you need when you need to. And while you're there, check out our vast library of obstetrics pigmonics. We've got a massive amount of the content you'll need to remember. Everything from gestational hypertension and preeclampsia assessment and interventions to eclampsia and so much more. So you can lock down everything you need to know forever. Play, quiz, and spaced repetition. Efficient, effective, and research proven to increase exam scores.